I'd like to introduce our sixth finalist, Anna Dearson. She's from the Department of Engineering. Dr. Tom Acker is Anna's major professor. The title of Anna's, Anna's three-minute research presentation is Solar Volta Photovoltaics, Variability, and Spatial Smoothing. Children are afraid of the dark, but energy companies, they're afraid of the light. They're afraid of solar PV or photovoltaics because they can't control them. Unlike conventional coal power plants that can just run constantly throughout the day, solar PV power plants have variable or changeable output due to the motion of passing clouds. This is scary to utility companies because it's their job to maintain a reliable power grid by always matching supply and demand resources, energy supply and energy demand. So if one of those supply resources is variable, this is of concern. This variability I'm talking about is shown in the top figure here. This is solar radiance measured over the period of an hour, um, and solar radiance is just a measure of incoming power in the sunlight, and it's measured at a single point sensor just like the one I'm shown working on in the figure. So if you imagine that this a radiance translates directly to the power output of a PV power plant, you see that output going from 50% of its output to 100% very rapidly. But what I look at is what happens when you take 25 irradiance sensors and spread them out over the area of that whole power plant. And that's what I'm showing in the second figure here. So the black line is that same single point sensor, and the other colored lines are the irradiances measured at those other sensors, which are each just a couple hundred feet apart. So you see that as the cloud passes over that area, you, each sensor sees those cloud motion at a slightly different time. The result of this is what we call spatial smoothing, and that's shown in the blue line in the bottom figure. So if you compare the two lines, the blue line is much smoother than the black line, and the blue line is what I determined using data from all those 25 sensors that were spread out. So you can compare the two again. The black line is the scary, choppy changes, and the blue line is much more gradual changes. And this is much easier for energy companies to plan to adopt onto the power grid. It's gonna cause fewer problems like voltage fluctuations, and it's not gonna have the increased costs that come with managing that changeable supply resource and supply and demand. And the good news is that this, ag this smoothing effect is only more pronounced the larger the power plants you have and the more and more power plants you have over a greater geographic area. So I say, bring it on. Let's take advantage of this abundant solar resource to provide for a clean energy future. Thank you.